My dad, when I was telling him that I wanted to switch majors, was like trying to tell me all these ways that like, you know, I could stick with it or whatever. Finally, I was like, no, I have, like, I can't, I can't do it. Like, I have to just switch. And that's when he goes, well, that's what I thought you should have been in the whole time. I was like, what? Find a ceramic artist that we liked and uh, make something kind of like you, not copy them, but make something of our own with their inspiration. Like the guy that I did, he always makes these weird like pots that kind of like they look like driftwood, except they're black and white. It's like ashy wood, but I want more color than that. So I'm just gonna use like textures of wood and things like that. It's weird. I like getting dirty. It doesn't bother me when I come here covered in clay. It's really frustrating to me when people say like find inspiration, but then they get mad when you copy it. So I'm trying not to copy this dude, but at the same time though, the idea is not completely my own. <laughs> Look up somebody else, but don't make something like theirs, but be inspired by it. And I like, picked him because his stuff looks like driftwood and it looks cool and I like wood and nature and stuff. I always have like these really awesome ideas and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna make some tree bark. Or, oh, I'm gonna make a mushroom. It's gonna be cool. And then it just doesn't work out. I just think I'm not good at thinking things through or having way too high of expectations on myself. Or maybe I think that I'm better than I am. Or it's gonna be easier than it is, but it's not. I hate this and love this all at the same time. Like, it's not gonna get a good grade, but I kind of just like it. Maybe it's just because it's like, you're but maybe you know, I don't know.